Yeah, okay. Let me just walk you through a day in the life. Uh, just the other day, I told you I'm moving. I'm moving. Now, the house I'm moving into, I got to get the gas turned on. I got to get the power turned on. I got to get the water. I mean, it's on, but now I got to pay for it. So now it's got to be in my name. And I got to make sure the sanitation's taken care of. And I got to make sure all the services are done. So what do you do? You go online, you fill out the applications. Well, maybe it's the right application. Maybe it's not the application. You don't know, but I'm, I'm trying to just do what I'm supposed to do as a citizen so I can pay my bills. Okay. And I, I don't want to be living in the dark. I don't want to be living in the heat. I don't want to be living in the cold. I want to take care of my things. You know, I'm an American. God forbid I want to have these first world things like air conditioning. Okay. So I call them up, get on the phone with them, uh, call the gas company, and they're like, um, we, don't, we don't even deal with this. And I'm like, you're the gas company. What do you mean? Well, we don't we deal with we don't deal with that. Like we deal with emergencies. Like if there's a leak or something like that, I'm like, no, no, no. Then transfer me because it's still you're with the same company, right? And I'm not gonna say the company's name. Yeah, I said, well, then transfer me to the other people that can get me the new service. Well, we can't do that. But what do you mean you can't do that? You you can't transfer the call. Can you give me the number to call uh, that that gets me past an automated system where I can talk to a human being? Uh, no, I can't do that either. Okay, so I say all that to say without taking you further down to my blood pressure level uh, and, and my stress point, now I'm supposed to start dealing with government bureaucrats who are going to tell me how to retrofit and winterize and solar panel my home. And I'm supposed to get rebates. I'm supposed to be incentivized. I'm supposed to go out there and just do all of these things to my home and then somehow go find that money. Yep. Yeah. I don't trust you. I don't trust you. One, it's a dumb idea. All right? Why, why don't we just give you a service and you pay for that service and be done with it? Let, let's try to get that kind of deal. You know, a little more streamlined rather than now. I got to go. Because, you know, I don't know about you guys, but uh, anybody read any tax codes recently? Anybody go out there and, and look at some of the IRS documents, try to understand that gibberish? Oh, no. But now they're going to start dealing with our homes and how you could save money. And they're going to talk to you like stu you're stupid. I want to see, um, I would like to see, here's what I want to know. Can someone find me the home of Energy Secretary, Secretary Jennifer Granholm? You know, you can, I can look up Jay-Z's house. I, I can find all these homes. I can find where celebrities live. I, I can find Brian Kavanaugh's house, apparently. The protesters could. So I want to see Energy Secretary Jennifer Granholm's home. Is there like a Google satellite map of, of her house? Because I'm just curious to see how many freaking solar panels are on top of it. I want to see. Can somebody, you know, let's see if we can find that picture out there. We'll come back to that idea later on. But I want to do a little search. And, and I want to find out what she's doing to retrofit her own home. Because I don't know about you guys, but historically speaking, these people like Leonardo DiCaprio that want to preach to me about the environment, they're usually the ones with the yachts and the private jets. The people who bark the loudest, they're the ones, just like, you know, oh, we got to bring, we got we to take care of the climate and the environment and all this kind of stuff. But China can, and India, they can do whatever they want to do. Russia, they could do whatever they want to do when it comes to the government. We just got to take care of America. We, we're not going to call out China on any of this stuff. So my point is, these people who preach the loudest, they ain't doing it themselves. They want you to do it. The peons.